Hello and welcome to Amelia's Cooking Show. This episode was paid for by Voxy, the mobile network that gives you endless social media and endless video. This is the cooking show where myself and a guest attempt to cook a delicious meal in front of a live studio audience. Wow, what a good looking young man. As always, we'll be using five very special key ingredients. The twist, I can't cook. Aww. Today's guest is comedian, actor, and first person on the show who thinks crochet is a legitimate pastime, Rose Matafeo. Thank you. Hey. That was kind of rude. No, no, no. I mean, yes, it was, but. It's a good hobby. So food, do you eat it? Sometimes, yeah, I do dabble. Can you cook? Yeah, I can. Sometimes I put a tea towel over my um, shoulder. I'm, I'm glad to hear that you're confident in the kitchen because Thank you. I am also confident in the kitchen. Are you? Yeah, Great. I'm very confident. Why are you doing a cooking show? I personally feel like there's a huge gap in the market for like a famous chef. Is there? Jamie Oliver, Gordon Ramsay. You feel the mood. Mary Berry. I saw her. What? I saw the, she had the recipe for They, I think she, she literally, she'd filmed this here. Look at her. This is just, Do you um, see that? I didn't know about this. You didn't know about the concept of celebrity chefs? No. You're gonna have to excuse me just for one second. Sorry. Booyah base. Just when you booyah base. You all done? Right, uh, so on to the ingredients. It's time for the ingredients. Should I? Should I? No, no, stop. Sorry. Not now. Okay. okay. I'm, okay, go now. Now? Now. Wow. Wow. No, don't look. Sorry. It's a surprise. So for these ingredients, we had a team of researchers working around the clock uh, on these. So I'll just get the first one now. Great. The first ingredient is rose flavoring. <laughs> because you are rose. I thought you were going to do some sort of clever like, oh, you know, no. sort of misdirect there, but no, literally, that's just my name. Yes. Cool. So, there you go. Have you tasted rose flavouring before? No. Does it taste like you? Uh, no. The smell of roses is quite old. Old? Do you know what I mean? Do you mean like an old lady? Smell that. Oh, that's old. It's musky. Yeah, that's, uh, that's old. It's musky as hell. Okay, thank you. Okay. Um, so, Rose, um, how did you start your career? I mean, I started when I was 15 years old. Oh, really? I, 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 yeah. I was not a very popular child, um, <laughs> but I had braces and... I had braces. Did you? Now it's time for the second ingredient. Awesome. Second ingredient is a kiwi. Because you love the color greeny brown. Greeny brown. Are you gonna hold it up like that? <laughs> I'll just put that down. Um, <laughs> you know what's very confronting? When someone's like, that's the key. So I just like to say that um, this was all an elaborate joke, and actually, the reason is because you're from New Zealand. Okay, very funny. I feel like if I hang around with people from New Zealand mm. or Australia mm. for too long, then I start having Doing the it. accent. It kind of happens. I mean, which accent do you prefer? I can't tell. tell. Sorry, what? Can you really not tell? Okay, the best way to tell it's how you pronounce the number six. Oh. So New Zealanders say six. Sucks. Yeah, sucks. And then Australians say six. Six? Like sex. Oh my god. Sex. 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 Oh, sorry. 
Are you doing a British accent? Six. No, say something more than six. Oh my, I, I watched The Crown. I'm very, oh. No, stop, 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 stop. What's it? Stop it. What's it? I don't know. Fair enough. And the next ingredient is a hot dog. Because <laughs> your last sold out show was called Horn Dog. Yeah. And this is one horny dog. <laughs> I'm gonna say it's the least horny dog I've ever seen. Have you ever seen a thinner, more flaccid, also dripping wet <laughs> dog? It's just, it's so illicit. <laughs> That is disgusting. It's very sad. It's Was your show sad? Was my show as sad as this, yes. what I'm looking at right now? Yes. It did have an element of melancholy that I think this hot dog represents. What would you say it was about, your show? My show was about horniness, mm. but emotional horniness. I don't know if you know what I mean by that, but like wanting to like, you know, get him a really nice candle or something. <laughs> And the final ingredient mm -hmm. is biscuits. Biscuits. Because. because oh, because I um I love them, love biscuits, and I uh ha my I come from I come from I come from a long line of biscuit biscuit make makers. Yes, I read that actually, that your family did yes. invent biscuits. biscuits. They, they invented the all biscuits. And didn't you once live, your In house a was That's, a biscuit. It was a biscuit house, yeah. It was In, famous yeah. because there was a big collapse and, yeah. you know, my auntie, well, I don't want to go into that, but like she, she died. And then I was like, I need to get away from this because it's like, I don't, that's not me. And I was trying to become a comedian. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. So that's all my ingredients, mm -hmm. Rose. Yes. Uh, it's time for your ingredients. So, thank you. Bring it out. I thought it, you'd never ask. Wow. Ta-da! What is that? I mean, it looks kind of crazy, but this is coconut cream. Coconut cream. The cream of the coconut. The cream of the coconut. How come you brought that? Uh I am half Samoan. In this country, everyone says Samoa, which is wrong. Uh, so, do you know? I was going to say that. You were going to say Samoa. So, thank you. So, uh, is that, is, so coconut's big there? Coconut's a big there. Mm. It's the Pacific Island, okay. Polynesia. Uh, and coconut cream is, is delicious. And I thought it would go with anything. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking it might not go with the hot dog. So, that's all the ingredients. Mm -hmm. um, now it's time to decide what to make. Oh, God. Let's go to discussion time. So, after much deliberation, we have decided to make a coconut, kiwi and rose cheesecake with a sausage on top. Oh, the sausage is not... Well, the sausage... It, sh it shouldn't traditionally be in a dessert. Well, it's not in a dessert, it's on top. Step one, we need to make the biscuit base. Oh, great. We need to crush the we biscuits crush up. Them. How with, do you want to crush them up? We could use, well, really we need a rolling pin, but we could use a masher. Dying this up. is working. This That's is, actually cool. This is actually good. <laughs> like, you take this. Okay, okay you, on, do we'll you do that, you do that. Oh, this is like ASMR. Oh. No, you can't, you can't have ASMR if you're going <laughs> over the top of it. It sounds like footsteps through the sand on a beach of your boyfriend walking away from you after a fight. That looks amazing. Yeah. You do some ASMR. Okay. Go on. Come. Yes. 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 Ooh. Oh, it's sizzling away. Now mix it up. Mix that up. All right. Yum. I could eat it at this point. Sorry, can I just say I can't believe how well this is this is going already. I know. 
I mean, we only we only have to break. <laughs> we are congratulating ourselves for literally crushing up biscuits and melting butter and putting it together. Yes. Is that high, high five. five? So at the moment, I feel like it's all biscuit. We've deconstructed biscuits and made a bigger biscuit. Oh, we have. We made, made a big, big biscuit. biscuit. Now we need to put this in the um, fridge to just to set for a bit. Okay. Good luck. Bye. Over there. The next step is we need to make the kiwi syrup. Kiwi. So you know how to do that because you're a kiwi. Kiwi. There we go. Should I put the kiwi in there? Yes, put the kiwi in. Okay. All right, there we go. Goodbye, old friend. Oh, oh gosh, it's sizzling. The kiwi Jesus. is going. It's, we're and frying sugar. kiwi. Look it's, at this, it's like slime. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's like slime. Are you ready? Corn flour. Yeah. Yes. Mix it up, girl. Come on. I mean, I, I don't know what this is going to do. <laughs> I don't know what it's doing either. Yeah, so you just literally just like whiz it around until it's a syrup or something. What are you doing? I'm watching something. Okay. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'll have a break as well. Okay. Get some fresh air. Okay. So. Voxy is the mobile network that now gives you endless video on top of endless social media, so you can stream as much as you want without eating into your data allowance. You can stream endless amounts of videos on YouTube and other video apps. I'm using it to take my cooking skills to the next level and be the professional chef I was born to be. With plans starting at £12 a month for a limited time only, the possibilities of your digital life are endless. Endless video plans come with 5G, which means zero lag when learning on the go, super fast download times and no buffering when streaming. Life can be unpredictable, so all Voxy plans are flexible. You can change, pause, or cancel at any time. <laughs> the reasons to switch to Voxy are honestly endless. This is, this is a toy. Okay, now it's time for step three. So if you could put that over oh, there. Yeah, you can, yeah, great. Um, now we need to make the filling of the cheesecake. That's... Oh. oh! Then, do you want to put that in? Coconut cream. Flour. Flour. Sugar. Um, Can you crack that one with one at hand? No, I'll try. Go on. Keep going. How did you feel that went? Stunning. When do we add the rose? Oh, the rose. Oh, this is maybe not the best. Illegal. Literally illegal. How much is it meant to be? Like, <laughs> a drop, Amelia. A drop. No. This is a disaster. No. This is, it smells like potpourri now. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah. There we go. This really, it does smell like, you know, if someone's done something in the toilet and then you have to spray the... Yeah. Oh my God. Okay, I don't know if this masher is okay, working. Okay, yeah, yeah, you give up on the masher. Oh, let's get... The let's get the electric, electric whisk. whisk. You've never used an electric whisk before. Ah! <laughs> Oh God, oh God! <laughs> Stop! Okay. okay. Wow, that was fun. I felt like I was out clubbing. Yeah. Now we need to add half of the kiwi mixture into here. Okay. Half. Amelia, because I know you struggle with quantities. Oh! It's like a chaos element in the kitchen. No! You just, you're Sorry. really excited. <laughs> Sorry. Mmm. Mmm, biscuits. Smells good and cold. Shall I? Shall I try? There is a lot of mixture. Yeah, I don't think all of the mixture is going to fit in. This is going well. Now swizzle. Swizzle it. Great. Perfect. Now this goes into the oven for 45 minutes. Oh, I just tasted that. And so good. It's so good. Okay. 
There we go. Fantastic. Um, so, I was just thinking about your new show. Yes. What's it called? Starstruck. Starstruck. You did your research. And uh, it's about being starstruck. Correct. I was just wondering if you needed any more actors for the show. The show. We've kind of like made it so it's like not. Um, so I could audition still. I mean, yeah, I and mean, we might make some like more more ones. Yeah. Well, if you want to. Well, audition. I've I've prepared like a little um, audition piece. Have you? you yeah. Um, oh. Just a little sh bit of Shakespeare. Art thou not fatal vision sensible? Sorry, was that was that it? No, was... that's that's just half of it. But I I don't know if you wanted me to go on. Honestly, do, do the rest. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. That was amazing. To feeling as to sight, or art thou but a dagger of the mind? That's it. That's it, my okay. sir. Thank you. Um, okay. So I would say, first of all, I think don't bring your own material. Often people will send out the scripts and be like, oh, can you learn this? And I think to come into the space auditioning for a comedy with a Shakespearean tragedy is like kind of the wrong tone. Mm -hmm. Oh, well. So now it's time for the final step. We need to take the cake out of the oven. Da 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 da. Amelia, what are you doing? Oh, girl, no, what? Now we're never gonna. Oh my god, you're gonna have to put it. <laughs> okay. That was. Fantastic. Worked out. Oh my god. And then the final step, obviously, is. No! No, please, no. We, we, we have to. Please, no? It's, it's an ingredient. But you chose the You can just. You put so many other ingredients in here. Why don't you just say we, that I, doesn't have, have to. Don't, 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 don't. Oh my god. You get a close up on that. It's underwhelming. So now it's time to plate up. Really? Do it. I'm excited. Let's okay. Do it. Okay. For the love of God. Mmm. It tastes nice. That's actually delicious. It's delicious. The thing is, though, I can like smell the sausage. That's the worst thing. Is like, that you can smell the sausage can, around it. I can just all I can smell is sausage. Ah, oh. are you gonna try the hot dog? I don't want to. Oh my god! Weirdly, it's not that bad. What? Honestly, try it. <clears throat> Strangely, it's not terrible. Oh my god! It's actually nice. Yeah, it's actually interestingly. That's maybe nice in the cake. Oh my god! That's psycho. That's actually psycho. So next time you're baking a cheesecake, just remember to put a little sausage on top. And you heard it here first. This episode was paid for by Voxy, the mobile network that gives you endless social media and endless video. Go to the link in my description to find out more about their plans. <sighs> what, a, what a beautiful show. Oh yes, what a... Jolly good job she's doing. Oh, it's a pleasure to be here in the audience.